Tennessee Senator Marsha Blackburn. Senator, uh, tell me what the course of action is that you have or plan to take. And Dagan, what we will do is look at it from several different committees that are standing committees here in the Senate. Uh, when you look at the suppression of information and the thwarting of Secretary Pompeo, we'll pick that up at Judiciary Committee. Then you have Commerce Committee that oversees big tech. And when you find out and see this email trail between Dr. Fauci and his team and Mark Zuckerberg and his team, where they're really running a PR strategy and cherry picking data and stats to build a narrative that they want to say Dr. Fauci was uh, covering himself and protecting himself, not the American people. That needs to be investigated. What happened with his agency in the Wuhan lab? That needs to be investigated. Of course, if there was a lab leak, why the investigation from State Department was thwarted. So you've got a myriad of oversight committees that need to be involved in figuring out that is the course of action, getting to the bottom of this. And why did they choose when they knew it could have been a lab leak to hide it from the American people? Why did they keep changing the narrative as to what you should and shouldn't do? Senator Blackburn, are, will Mark Zuckerberg be called to testify on this issue? Mark Zuckerberg should be called to testify on this issue. Dagan, look, three and a half million people on the face of the earth have lost their lives because of COVID. If it turns out that they knew early on that there was the possibility of an engineered virus and a leak from that lab, and there was work to suppress this information, of course, that is something that should be delved into. And this needs to be done under oath. And, you know, think about the people that have lost their lives or livelihoods because of COVID. The children that lost a year of learning that have been disadvantaged because that are now suffering physical and emotional problems because of this. The American people deserve to know what happened with their tax dollars as far as this research goes. They deserve to know what Dr. Fauci, the highest paid federal employee we have, what he did and what kind of information he covered up and what he chose to expose and why. And the bigger issue, Senator Blackburn, you know this better than anybody, is the Section 230 uh, liability protection yes. that all these social media platforms have. So if Facebook would just, if they're going to collude and coordinate with, with politicians and uh, political figures of their liking, say people on the left and liberals, yeah. that's fine, but they just need to come out and admit it, but they won't because, again, that would jeopardize their liability protection, would it not? Well, it would, and that is why, as you well know, I started three years ago trying to reform Section 230 right. to remove those protections from big tech and reserve them for new entrants. And that has to be done. The virtual you protection agenda, looking at privacy, data security, antitrust, and Section 230 reform, these are things I think you'll see us make some headway this year. But this may be the straw that breaks the camel's back, mm -hmm. if you will, when it comes to big tech and how they overreach. The fact that Mark Zuckerberg contacted Dr. Fauci and said, hey, buddy, I want to help you with this. And then they start to create this narrative and run a PR campaign instead of saying to the American people, we're going to find out how this originated. We're going to force our way into that Wuhan lab because we have money in that lab. And Dagan, right. as you remember, Tom Cotton, Marco Rubio, me, we all got sanctioned by China. We were forbidden from going to China. We were banned. They didn't want us there. Of course not. They didn't want Mike Pompeo doing an investigation mm -hmm. through the State Department because of what they knew people may find. And the WHO was covering for them. So coming clean for the WHO, for the right. Chinese Communist Party, for what you had right. Fauci doing with the lab, we need to know those answers. And Facebook. Senator Blackburn, great to see yes. you. Thank you so Good much for your you. time, Thank always. You.